grateful that, Courtney, you're here uh, to tell us about the Samuel Goldwyn Child Care Center through the MPTF. So if you can talk a little bit about that um, and how that helps our members, that would be great. Absolutely. Um, such great messages tonight. By the way, I'm, I'm a man-to-man -man defense. I've got two kids, so the zoners out here, I... <laughs> More power to you. And you do, you, you're, you learn resiliency being in this industry and you bounce back and I think it behooves everybody. Um, so the Samuel Golden Family uh, Foundation Children's Center, it's, uh, it, 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 let me ask, anyone in the, in, in the audience has heard of this? Couple, yeah, this is, this is kind of part of the problem with MPTF, which is gonna be a 100-year-old organization in 2021, which is crazy because a lot of people know, yeah, M exactly, that part. So people know MPTF as like the country home or some big events we do. It's so much more than that um, and it's serving the people in the community and one of the most wonderful things that we do is this Samuel Golden Family Foundation Children's Center which is on uh, Sepulveda and uh, Olympic basically. It's on Pontius but you've probably driven by it a million times. And so there's, there's a couple of things to say about that. One, uh, this place is open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. For people working in the industry, for moms, for dads, those hours are phenomenal. It's very hard to find. Uh, the, the cost, of, first of all, by the way, being a nanny is a really great job. I think a lot of people should look into that because I didn't realize how expensive it is to try to get your children taken care of. My, um, my mom drove from Arcadia, kind of like Riverside, to where I live in Inglewood um, for my first daughter's two years every day to help me. My God, am I blessed for her. And then Child 2 came around and she was like, good luck, good luck. Uh, so, you know, that's okay, that's okay. You know, she didn't want to make that commute. Um, and she's the best nana in the whole world. But, so the, the Goldwyn Center is an incredible place. And I, I don't want to lie, I'm very transparent. It's not a cheap school. It's not like you can pay $500 a month. It, child care out here is expensive. I grew up in the public school system. So I'm learning how to navigate LA private schools and charter pu public and private. Um, it's operated by Bright Horizons. If people know this, right? Bright Horizons is fantastic. But we have financial aid. And I was just sitting with Kay Connors, our director, who not everyone even takes advantage of the child, um, the financial aid. Like, it's not that hard. It's extra paperwork. I hate paperwork. I have student loan debts. Like, it's, it's the worst, but just take the time to do it. So I will say, like, put that investment in to figure out what need. And it's not just based on what you make. It's based on your life's expenses. So if you think, like, gosh, I, I make a decent salary. There's people below the line making a lot less than me but it's, it's what your life costs, and then we will help you do that. And if you can't get financial aid for the Children's Center, um, it's literally why we exist to help this industry. So you might not get financial aid for your Children's Center, but if you have a job and then you find yourself out of work for six weeks or six months, or you have a catastrophic illness or a parent, um, we help with those daily living expenses. You can apply. And there's some fantastic resources out there. We don't have a cap on that, that, fi that duration or the amount. Um, you know, there's limitations based on need, but we, we help you to get back on your feet. So just consider that as a resource. We have an intake line. We do have eligibility. The good thing for the Children's Center is your eligibility is, do you work in the industry? Prove it, you can come here. Um, some other services are like seven years to live on the campus. It's 20 years in the industry or a spouse of. So, but call us and we'll take your call. And if it's not us to help, we refer. We, a lot of people say, well, a referral is not a service. It is though, because our referrals lead to help. So, um, I know that Jennifer Lewisell has helped you and she is, she is a goddess. She's a wizard. She helps with our insurance services and she also has partnered with the Actors Fund as well. So our resources, part of us getting out there is the education and, and awareness of what we do. Um, we have drop-in hours. Kay Connors, I will share her information with Jen to share with everybody. I asked, because I'm still learning about some of the eligibility. Some of it's complex in what we do. The eligibility for that is, guess what? Call Kay in advance and drop them off. We'll take your kids. 
if you have an audition and they don't go to our school. Um, they do have to be the ages, so it's six months to kindergarten, and we have an actual kindergarten, and just drop them off. You need help, we'll take care of you. It's fantastic. I mean, it's, yeah, it, it, it is. It's like, you're, you know. Where is this again? I'm sorry. Mind-blowing. Where and is this? We're all taking notes. The yeah. singers want to sing a little angelic. Uh, <laughs> Hallelujah. What part of town is this? Where is this? We would like to use that on our next commercial. Um, so it's, it is on Sepulveda in between LaGrange and Olympic. Um, the entrance is actually on Pontius, which is parallel to Sepulveda. You've probably driven by it nine million times. It's like primary colors, red, yellow, green. See, yeah, you, I, I went to UCLA, I played soccer. Like I never knew that this place was a thing. I'm like, where is this school? Oh, I've seen it a million times. And we have, a, we have a video, which when I started MPTF, I saw this mom and she was like, oh, at first, you know, and my first was very insecure, cried all the time when I would leave her and I, had, I felt a lot of guilt. Um, maybe it's the second child, maybe it's just the love that she got, uh, the way that we treated her, I don't know, but they have this thing at the Goldwyn Center where you push your parents out the door. <laughs> and we say, you know, they say, go, you know, push, push mommy out the door, and she cannot wait to push me out the door. She can't wait for me to get back home, but she pushes me out the door, and I love it. Um, I asked to bring donuts the other day, and they're like, no, 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 just fruits and vegetables, and, but, but the teachers will take the donuts. So it's just, I guess what I would say about MPTF is like, get to know us. There are a million resources. We have over 55 services, 25 plus social workers. It is literally exists, Mary Pickford, Douglas Fairbanks, D.W. Griffith, Charlie Chaplin, to take care of our own. Awesome. As simple as that sounds, it's, it is what it is. So um, it's hard. It's hard to be in this industry, but we're glad you're in it. Don't leave it. Don't, don't go be a nanny, even though I said to do that. <laughs> or maybe you need to a little bit, but um, it's, it's pretty phenomenal. And, and it's the love, and it's the care, and it's your peers, and it's creative, and it's, it's fantastic. Awesome. awesome.